This is Brad Close with the Tulip team at Remax. Welcome to Smith Falls. Right now I'm standing at the front main entrance to the town hall of the town of Smith Falls. After the War of 1812, the United Empire Loyalists from the United States were allowed to come to this area. However, they weren't allowed to go as far north as Perth, the largest British military station. Just south of here is the Rideau Canal, which was proclaimed in 2007 a UNESCO World Heritage Site. I'm here standing in front of the main business street of Smith Falls. An interesting historical fact is that when wars occurred, this was the town where the soldiers met and then marched down the main street of the town and then got on the Rideau Canal and went to the location of whatever war they were fighting in. I'm standing here in front of the original post office for the town of Smith Falls. This building is designated heritage. It was totally renovated by Bruce Linton. The first floor is all commercial. There's residential apartments on the second and third floors and the, the lower level is also commercial. I'm here standing in front of the main entrance to the Smith Falls Library. This library was donated to the town by the famous man Andrew Carnegie who was the steel baron and major bridge builder in the United States. He donated many libraries to major towns and cities all over North America. His name will never be forgotten. I'm standing here in front of 22 Maple Avenue. This was the area of Smith Falls where the upper management of the railroad lived, evident in all the large mansions that are here, many which were converted into apartment buildings just like 22 Maple Avenue here. This is one block west of the main business street back with, yet it's close to all the amenities of the business section. It was an ideal location for the upper management people to reside. I'm standing here in front of a new 35 unit building here on the corner of Maple Avenue and William Street West. There's been a very high level of new construction here, mostly new apartment buildings in this town. I'm here standing in front of the Rideau Canal in Smith Falls, which was built between 1826 and 1832. The canal will connect you all the way to the Atlantic and all the way to Lake Ontario. And behind me is many boats owned by the business La Boat. So if you want to take a tour to either of those destinations, here's the place to come to. I'm here at Lower Reach Park with trails that run all along the Rideau Canal. There's many activities that can be done here, like you can play tennis, you can play soccer in the soccer fields, and the other various athletic activities. Welcome to the Smith Falls Memorial Community Centre, the home of the Smith Falls Bears, who play in the Central Junior A Hockey League. There was a few NHL players that played for the Smith Falls Bears, one of which was Billy Smith, who went on to win the Memorial Cup with the Cornwall Royals and then became an NHL superstar with the New York Islanders winning four Stanley Cups. Today he's a member of the Hockey Hall of Fame. Welcome to the Perth and Smith Falls Hospital which underwent a huge expansion here in Smith Falls. Anybody looking to come to this area, uh, usually they're looking for a really good hospital in case of you know emergencies. So this is a big selling feature of this town and people love this hospital. For anyone looking to buy in a booming and growing town at Smith Falls, this town is growing at an incredible level. It is a newer community centre, doubled uh, the size of the hospital, revamped downtown, new water treatment plant and a new high school. So this town has poured all kinds of money into their downtown, etc. And so this is the place to be. So for any of your real estate needs, call Brad Close with the Tulip Team, 613-200-1000.